What's up, Alpha Pack? It's your boy, Josh. Yeah. And I'm here just kicking it right here with my dogs. Yeah, called Chilling. And, uh... <laughs> oh! Uh, by the way, uh... It is my second vlog. Yesterday was an introduction to my vlog. <laughs> uh, and uh, this is going to be my vlog. By the way, I have Tourette's, which is all that yee and all that stuff. Um, <coughs> so, uh, introductory blog, uh, vlog. 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 I'm a vlogger guy, just like I said yesterday. If you don't know, now you know. Yeah. So, <laughs> if you did not see the first video, check it out in the Alpha Pack Vlogs. Um join the alpha pack hit that like and subscribe button i'm gonna be coming to you every day <coughs> for the new video uh by the way today uh if you don't know about this channel what we're gonna be talking about is pretty much anything and everything <coughs> like i did say yesterday i'm a quarterback quarterback for who you say i'm a quarterback for the denver broncos on the practice squad <laughs> Right. No, I'm not. It's a joke for all the people who aren't paying attention. I did say it's a joke. You're going to be like, he's a Broncos quarterback, bro. But I'm not. I'm actually a quarterback for a team. It is called the Apex Predators. I'm the starting quarterback. <laughs> and that brings me to something I wanted to talk about real quick. <coughs> uh, again, Tourette's. So, this is right here. It's called an Under Armour rib shirt. Okay? So, let me throw this up here for you. This is called the Under Armour Rip Shirt, okay? And the reason I am showing you this is because I got hit in the ribs playing with a cracked rib. <coughs> uh, got hit in the ribs of practice. <coughs> uh, and if you know, you're not supposed to hit the quarterback in practice. Yeah, got hit in practice, cracked my rib. Uh, had a game last Sunday, we won. Um, <coughs> uh, Got hit in the rib again, uh, had my Under Armour shirt on, <coughs> dude just laid right into my ribs, and uh, if you don't know, rib shots suck, especially when you have a cracked rib, and so, <laughs> uh, the reason I'm doing this is I will be reviewing certain products on this channel also, <coughs> uh, <coughs> uh, also be talking football, um, but this Under Armour rib shirt. It really helped. If I did not have this rib shirt on, probably would have a broken rib right now. <laughs> Went out for two plays, uh, drive was over, um, and then, you know, that was that. But, <laughs> if you are not a quarterback, uh, or you are a quarterback, if you are a football player, I would heavily uh, recommend this Under Armour uh, rib shirt. Also, there's an Evo Shield rib shirt, uh, very hard to find. Uh, but it kind of, it, 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 uh, kind of, what do you call it? Whatever you call it. It, uh, molds, uh, comes in rubber, kind of put it on. It gets really hard, molds to your body. Those are really protective. <laughs> you want to protect your ribs, uh, especially if you're quarterback, when your arm's up, you're throwing, so on and so forth. You don't want to get hit in the ribs. Uh, also, another thing I wanted to talk about, yeah, is my boys, my team, my guys. If you don't know, Denver Broncos, that's my squad, that's my guys, that's my team, that's my bro -hams. I'm from Denver, so, <laughs> I'm going to be talking to some Broncos, you know, sometimes, like I said, um, and uh, one thing I wanted to talk about is the running back competition, everyone's talking about the quarterback competition, I'm a quarterback, of course, I love quarterbacks, I love Trevor, I love Pax, I love Chad Kelly, he's going to be a beast when he's healthy, by the way, <laughs> um, so, you know, the one thing I want to talk about now, though, is uh, Jamal Charles, C.J. Anderson, Devontae Booker, and the new kid. Uh, he is a running back uh, that we drafted later rounds. Who do you think is going to be the starting running back for the Denver Broncos? <laughs> Will it be my boy C.J. Anderson? By the way, he is awesome. He's a beast. He's cool. He's super tight. I met that dude, and, uh, you know... A lot of famous people, football players, people, and in general, they're kind of like, <laughs> oh, yeah, autograph, oops, oops, for sure, bro. <laughs> Bye. And they're kind of, you know, not jerks, but they're kind of, yeah, you're a fan, cool, we got to put up with you. The really cool football players, they're super tight, they appreciate you, they love you. <laughs> CJ Anderson is one of these guys. When I met CJ Anderson, <laughs> he, uh, he had like a tons of people around him, <coughs> and uh, I talked to him, I was like, what's up, man, how you doing, he looked me in the eye, I talked to him for five minutes straight before he moved on, 
and talk to some more people like about the Super. This was before Broncos won Super Bowl 50. Uh, the year before, uh, he was not yet the starter. Um, <laughs> uh, I was talking about you gonna make it to the Super Bowl, so, so so on and so forth. He said that's the plan. Like super cool guy. CJ is a beast. But now we got this guy Jamal Charles. By the way, I call CJ Anderson CJ the Rhinoceros Anderson. Yeah, because he runs people over. He's a beast. Also, I'm, I came up with uh, uh, Emmanuel Sanders. The nickname I came up with him is a uh, He Man. He Manuel Sanders. <laughs> Yell that out. Put it out. Put it all over. Uh, I came up with that. Uh, sent that nickname to my boy Brandon Perna from That's Good Broncos. Check him out if you don't know about That's Good Broncos. Check that. Uh, check his channel out. Uh, he also does That's Good Sports. Uh, you've, if you've watched him, you know that he says. Uh, he, Manuel Sanders, he also gave me credit for coming up with it. Uh, check his channel out. <coughs> uh, so, He, Manuel Sanders, uh, CJ the Rhinoceros Anderson, Tasmanian Shaney and Ray, <laughs> Von Miller, I call him V. Muggsy, uh, Von Bon Vanilovich. Anyway, you can tell Broncos are my team. Not only going to talk about the Broncos this year uh, on my vlog, uh, I will talk about other things, other teams, so on and so forth. Uh, torment your favorite team. I'll talk about them. Um, <laughs> but back to what I was saying about uh, CJ the Rhinoceros Anderson. And uh, uh, Devante Booking Booker, by the way, uh, if you guys come up with nicknames, shoot them into the comments. Uh, I will put, if, if you put something really tight, I will shout you out in the video, let you know about the, or shout out your nickname to the people watching the vlog. Uh, uh, that's a perfect time to say, if you want to be shouted out, comment in it, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, become part of the alpha pack. And that's that, bro. But who do you think is going to be the starting running back for the Denver Broncos? I think a lot of people are underestimating Jamal Charles. <laughs> I think he is still a beast. Always has been a beast. I mean, he he's a monster, bro. That's just that's that. You know, he's a small guy, super fast, making people just juke him out the way. And I want to know what you guys think. Is it going to be CJ the Rhinoceros? Is it going to be Jamal Charles? Which I haven't came up with a cool nickname for him yet. Because he was a chief, not a Bronco. And, you know. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, if you guys got a cool nickname for Jamal Charles, put it out there on the comments. Let me know what it is. And uh, we'll see what's up. Now, my input <laughs> is Jamal Charles, if he's 100% healthy, I think he may win the starting job. And I love CJ. He's my boy. He's a beast. Like I said, super cool. Uh, he was real cool to me. And, uh, <laughs> you know, I, I love the guy. He's awesome. Uh, I don't know who will win the starting job, but I think Jamal Charles, if healthy, and uh, I think he will be healthy. He did say that he was not able to get fully healthy with the Chiefs <laughs> the last two years. And the Broncos want him to be fully healthy, obviously. I do think Jamal Charles could be our starting running back. Why? Because he can catch, he can run, so can CJ, but he has that kind of receiver uh, tendency, with ability, receiver ability to him also. <laughs> so, I do believe that, uh, hold on, Bobo's going in over here. Yeah? What are you buffing? This is a buffer. Yeah. Oh, by the way, this is my 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 other dog, Chucky Wug, Charlie dog. Charlie, say what's up. Yeah, nah. Screw you. Yeah. So, um, anyway, <laughs> I think that Jamal Charles could be the starting running back. I do believe that. I think that he has the ability. Then CJ, I think they should split carries. Uh, third down running back who can block back. Bubba, come here, come here, come here. Trying to do that vlog life, bro. She not, oh, Charlie's saying what's up to the vlog. Vlog life. Um, anyway, so, like I said, comment who you think should be the starting running back this season, 2017 season for the Denver Broncos. Uh, also, uh, before uh, we end this vlog, I'm going to, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Trying to vlog here, bro. <laughs> she don't care. She's 
She's talking her own vlog over there. So, the one more thing I want to talk about uh, that I will be talking about tomorrow is the quarterbacks. You know, Peyton Manning, Aaron Rodgers, Drew Brees. <laughs> Usually in the offseason, they all get together. They do kind of a, uh, what do you call it? A uh, passing camp with each other receivers. Broncos did not do this this year. <laughs> Amanda Sanders wanted to, but they didn't. Um, <clears throat> Uh, I will be talking about that more tomorrow, um, and, uh, I heard some things about why would they do it now, so on and so forth, I'm about to trip on the hose, <laughs> um, anyway, want to comment, comment more about that tomorrow, hit me up on the comment section, let me know who's your favorite quarterbacks, uh, who's your favorite running backs, who's your favorite team, like I said, I will rap about all your teams, <laughs> excuse me, <clears throat> um, I'm pretty, this is not just a pure football channel, by the way. Just had the topic today of football. Uh, like I said, I'll talk about anything, pretty much. Um, <laughs> talk about me, my dogs. It's a vlog, you know? Uh, so, football, like I said, I'll try to get you guys uh, uh, some footage of my practices with my team. Uh, I'll try to get you some game footage. Um, get uh, my mom or someone on the sidelines to film. Uh, <laughs> Um, by the way, pretty soon, gonna try to get a uh, GoPro um, for the vlog, so on and so forth. So, uh, hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, tune in tomorrow, gonna put a video up every day. Uh, like I said, new, new to this vlog life, bro, but gonna be putting a video up every day. So, comment. Uh, tell me what you want, what you like, what you want to talk about, you know, who's your favorite team, who's your favorite quarterbacks, uh, my favorite quarterback is Peyton Manning, <laughs> uh, probably obvious, uh, and then Aaron Rodgers, and then Kurt Warner, uh, if you don't know who Kurt Warner is, check him out, he's a beast, he's awesome, um, anyway, uh, before I end this vlog, let's sneak up on my Bobo real quick, <laughs> yeah, what's up Bobo, what's up Bobo, yeah, 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 so, there it is, uh, that's what's up, alright Alpha Pack, I will wrap to you tomorrow, hope you enjoyed the video, it's my second video only, uh, I will end with a shot real quick, uh, my other football, we'll use this one, it's a little ripped up from practice obviously, but, I will hit a shot, and then, we'll wrap to you tomorrow, so, oh no, can't end like that. Just can't in like that, bro. Now, one more. Oh, there's the good ball right there. So, just can't end on that throw. And I'm not going to edit it out. I'm not. You know? Uh, so, there you go. One more throw before we take off and wrap tomorrow. Ready? Okay. Should have got it in. Didn't get it in. It's all good. So... Let's see. Uh, bye bye. Should I throw one more? I think she's saying yes, throw one more. So, here we go. One more throw. Oh! Here we go, one more. And then, uh, I'll wrap you tomorrow. Hut! Alright, fam. Take it easy. Wrap you tomorrow. If it's easy, take it twice. Peace! <laughs>